How upset are you? You seem pretty upset right now. No, I'm happy about it. It's great. Good news. Their guy charges the mound being an idiot, and our guy's going to be out for however long, and their guy will probably be playing in three days. It's a joke. That was, of course, a very, very unhappy Don Mattingly, the manager of the L.A. Dodgers, after a brawl or a fight between their pitcher, Zach Granke, and Carlos Quinton, after Quinton got hit with a pitch. He charged the mound, and Granke's left now with a broken collarbone after all of that. Pretty much the worst way that could end, at least for Granke. Now, obviously, the Dodgers are all very unhappy. Matt Kemp actually went to find Quinton in the locker room after the game. And uh, it was broken up before anything could really get out of hand, but clearly there is some bad blood between these teams. If there wasn't before, there most certainly is now. Obviously, people taking to Twitter to voice their opinions and put in their two cents in terms of this brawl. This person tweeted that Carlos Quinton and Zach Granke fight was probably one of the worst baseball fights I've ever seen. Somebody swing. You know what? Fair enough. And Bill Platschke said gutless Quinton should be suspended for as long as Granke is out. Of course, that won't happen. But you know what? I kind of agree with him because Granky's going to be out for a while. Brad tweeted, there is no question Granky said something to Quinton. Seems like he only said, come at me, bro. But you know what? That's probably enough to incite a fight. And Harry tweeted, so it's Quinton's fault that Granky got hurt? What if Quinton got hurt from the pitch like Granderson did? He hit a batter. It's fair game. Of course, Granderson fractured his forearm after he got hit with the pitch. So he makes a good point. And Andy asks the mo most important question of all, what if... You have both Granky and Quinton on your fantasy team. Who do you root for in the brawl? You know what? I don't have the answer to that. That is a very, very tough question. Now, if you'd like to watch some baseball tonight that doesn't, well, hopefully doesn't involve any fighting, you're in luck. The Blue Jays are in Kansas City taking on the Royals, and we have coverage of that game on Sportsnet Ontario and Sportsnet Pacific beginning at 7.30 p.m. Eastern with Blue Jay Central. So check it out. It's definitely worth checking out, and hopefully, like I said, no fights involved in that game. Anyway, that's all we've got for now, but check back here in a little bit for another Sportsnet Digital Dose.